All right, I'm back at it with Armored Core, and as promised, I created my emblem. Now, at first I was trying to create Jack's emblem, which is like the skull with the wrenches and chain around it. Um, let me just show you guys. Image editor. But, you know, I'll put up pictures so you can, this is where I got, you know, I was trying to, but I was running into a lot of problems. The nose is all wrong. The eyes are all wrong. And this, this skull doesn't have a forehead to have like the skull, like the wrenches poking through. And also there's no wrench. So I'd have to create one using the parts that we have. And I was having a really hard time. So I decided, let me try the Mad World logo, which I think came out pretty well, not perfect by any means, but I kind of like it because as you can see, I put it on the side of my tank <laughs> and it looks pretty sick. So I'm happy with it. You know, maybe if I uh, fiddle with it a bit more, I can make, you know, the skull emblem too and have it on like the back of my mech or something. That would be cool. But that's where we're at right now. Uh, I'm pretty happy with the Mad World logo, but you know, that's enough about my logo. Let's get into it, shall we? I've been looking forward to playing again, so it's only been a day, but I'm addicted. Got a job for you, 621. The client is the Rubicon Liberation Front. Here's the briefing. The loss of the wall dealt us a heavy blow. Yet, we believe you are more than a corporate pawn. Perhaps we can even work together. I want you to investigate Baus Arsenal Number 2, a major MT factory in the Bellius region. The Baus Corporation sells to anyone, but they've been essential to maintaining our firepower. Now, their second arsenal has gone silent overnight. If it were only a comms failure, a simple check-in would do. But, well, after the Strider, more cautious voices have gained influence. This isn't our finest moment, but would appreciate your help. All right. I'm not sure which side. They seem like the good guys, if there even is good guys. Wow, look at that. The Mad World on the tank treads. You gotta, you gotta admit that's pretty cool, right? You got to. Or if you don't, then you don't got to, but you should. Some advice before you go, 621. Expect the unexpected. Oh, you think they're ambushing me? That that'd be interesting. Or maybe not. I don't know. I'm probably just talking like a psycho that has no idea what they're talking about. Oh yeah, look at that. The mad world down there. I put it on both sides, baby. I've been checking the perimeter, and I'm picking up nothing. What happened here? Boom! Sorry, satellite dishes. Where's mowing everything over, bro? Quiet. Yeah, it's an ambush. Oh gosh. Get up there. You punk. Am 
I'm out of juice. This son of a gun. Oh, here we go. I'm trying to get on this thing. Remaining. I'm not doing a very good job. I did a very, very bad job there. We're not done yet. The first level I've got my my emblem on. I'm doing it. I'm doing very poorly. It's got you in its sights. Too late. Six to one. I think there's more than one this time. Use your skin. Mark your targets to undermine their tricks. It's a very cool mission, I'm not gonna lie, but... Alright, <laughs> we took care of business there. Yeah, we're still not done. We're out of repair no kits. Repair kits remaining. Okay. It's okay. We got this. Maybe he'll give me a resupply. Like that one time. Goodness. <laughs> ah! <laughs> no doubt about it. This water. It contains faint traces of coral. Must have been an underground vein. Mouse was hiding a well all of this time. Oh no.
<laughs> wow, okay. This is a wild one right here. Four of them, okay. At least we got a checkpoint. This game's pretty forgiving in that, where it gives you a checkpoint and refills your... Is that um, response? Your repair kits and Get stuff. Get down and take a closer look. Last of them. Alright, that was a tough one right there. Seems that's the last of them. This wasn't a simple check-in after all. Head back and rest up, 621. Dude, I love the boost kick where you just slam them with the treads. <laughs> I love that so much. It does good damage. Like, I broke that guy's shield, hit him with a rocket, and then boost kicked him. Bada bing, bada boom. Long time no see, Walter. Looking good for a change. I see you've got a new augmented human. What happened to 617 and the rest? Their jobs. They did what it took to get us here. Huh. So how's the newcomer doing? Adequately. But Gen 4 augmentation can be unstable. We need to choose our battles. How's things on your end? I found the data our friends left behind. There's something promising in the watch point. <laughs> I don't know, the Mad World thing just puts a smile on my face. One new message. Back, 621. About the coral well that was found at Baus Arsenal number two. That was just a drip coming from an underground vein, and it won't last long. It's not the coral we're searching for. One more thing. I've sent you your next job. This one isn't from the Corps or the Liberation Front. You'll see when you check the briefing. All right. Anything new? No. I 
I kind of like the assault armor. We'll do that. Click in less stick and press Y. Interesting. Do I have to equip it? Oh, I do under the assembly. Oh, expansion. Assault armor expansion. Okay, nice. So it'll make me immune to damage for a short bit and do damage in an area around me, it seems like. Attack the watch point. Let's do it. This is a rather personal request from a friend of mine. It concerns a certain facility, a watch point. Once, it regulated the underground flow of coral. Now, it serves to monitor the dormant veins. I want you to attack it. Your objective will be to destroy the sensor valve at its core. The watch point is kept secure by SG, the planetside PCA force, which means it's too hot for the corporations to be seen there. In other words, we're flying strictly solo on this one. All right. I'm still getting paid, right? I mean, I'm a mercenary. Okay, I'm getting paid a lot. Let's do it. You'll be going in under cover of darkness. Be ready for anything. Are they going to be more than cloak fellas? What do you guys think? Do you like the tank or do you like the bipedal? Main system activating combat mode. Leave no evidence. If anyone sees you, handle it. Code one five. Intruder sighted. It's just one AC. Who are they with? We can look into that later. Engaging. down nice and low bad not too bad it can be a little hard to maneuver with the tank sometimes where did that AC come from what happened to the patrol squad code 1 -8. all units deploy for combat exposed to snipers from all quarters keep moving or they'll shoot you down Over here? Yeah. 
We're just gonna take the main bridge, baby. Dude, this is a regular high three-lane highway, and this is how big our AC is on it. We take up the whole freaking thing. <laughs> Coming in hot. Watch point. You're incorrigible, Handler Walter. How many of your dogs must I kill before you learn? Is that Sua? Pitiful dog. I feel sorry for you. I really do. You may have survived a little longer. Well, you had a different master. C124 Sua. He's an independent mercenary who survived first gen augmentation. Don't think twice, 621. Kill him before he kills you. We're out of our heels. Enemy AC destroyed. Forget about him, 621. You did good today. Yeah, look at that. We take up the whole highway. Penetrate the control center and destroy the target. Alright, let's get in there. Oh, I forgot. I have my expansion. I should have been using that. When we were up close on each other like that, probably been good. Oh yes, a resupply. That's what I'm talking about. I can probably skip the resupply, right? Yeah. Yo, sometimes, yeah, I don't know. But that means we're gonna have a, whoa. What, are we supposed to go in? I see no input, you drop a lot faster. Oh, one rocket. Oh, never mind. Okay, what are we gonna have to deal with now? Good job, 621. It wouldn't resupply us just for that. We're done here. Head back to base. Are we? Uh, probably our first like true really difficult boss who are you uh my name is jeremy i mean the king of pikmin of augmented human fourth generation have we made contact i am air a rubiconian Please, you must wake up. Before your consciousness is forever scattered in the coral flow. Interesting. Okay, so the Rubiconians are trapped in like some. in the coral, whatever the coral flow is. Is the coral from previous. Armored core games. I don't know the first thing about the lore. I really don't. So, hopefully, they go over it a little bit more. Confirmed. Disabling autopilot. Establishing comms link with Henry. Raven. I've identified an approaching enemy. I'll 
Whoa. Yo, that thing's actually tight, though. Oh my gosh! doing okay admit that was a valiant first attempt right you have to let's hope it's not one of those things where i do worse now you know what i mean where sometimes your first attempt you're like doing pretty well but then second third fourth whatever all right let's see Third tries the charm. Third tries the charm. The waves are intensified. Raven, get clear.
Oh, yeah, there we go. Third time's the charm, boys. Oh. Keep blasting this fool. Oh, I used up all of my shoulder cannon. Okay, that was intense. It was a lot of fun, though. Raven. You need rest. But first, a warning. The coral surge you were swept up in? That was just a glimpse. A premonition of the storm of flame that will burn Rubicon. Wow. Okay. The plot thickens. Trying to pull the wool over my eyes there, Walter. I thought we were friends. Raven. The coral explosion completely vaporized Northwestern Bellius's Bay Area. How do we survive that junk? I mean I know ACs are durable, clearly, but compared to the fires of Ibis, that explosion was hardly a spark. Raven. I have a favor to ask. Let me remain in contact with you until we reach the Coral Convergence. Well, how am I going to sever contact anyway? I have to see where they're taking us. Like, even if I wanted to. How this struggle over the Coral ends. I must, as a Rubiconian. I mean, sure, why not? You're not bothering me. It's a mad, mad world here on Rubicon. Augmented human, C4621, entering standard mode. Two new messages. Six two one, I've got some business to attend to. I need to hog some intel to the corpse and secure a backer for our trip to the ice field. One job for you while I'm out. Rest up. That's an order. Raven. I see your handler is away on business for now. About that trip to the ice field, we've received a job from Balaam already. Let's so I've got two look. handlers now? Registration number RB23. Call sign Raven. Your records have been updated. E rank virtual encounters are now Heck available yeah. in the arena. I love the arena. We invite you to hone your technique. Invitation accepted. New parts. Chainsaw. Chainsaw. Ooh. Gatlin gun. Right. <laughs> How do I not go for a Gatlin gun, you know? Ooh, grenade launcher. Napalm bomb launcher. <laughs> Laser shotgun, nah. 
missile launcher. No, no. Yo, please let me put pile bunker. Oh, it's my left arm. Pile bunker. This weapon bores to the target with a massive steel pile, obliterating it through sheer physical force. Charged to prime the firing hammer, enabling attacks that are enhanced by explosive damage. Uh, say no more. We're getting that right away. Come on, let me get some rockets or something. Ooh, grenade cannon. Heck yeah, finally. Pulse buckler. Alright, you know what? I'm gonna keep... I'm gonna keep the laser cannon on my back. But for the left hand, instead of the shotgun... Yeah, I'm sorry. But instead of the shotgun... Where's that pile bunker? Oh, there it is. We're getting the pile bunker, man. We have to. And then instead of the bazooka in our right hand, we're gonna put Gatling gun. And then on my right shoulder, instead of missiles, we're gonna do the grenade cannon. now yeah we're getting we're getting loaded up that head looks super whack i refuse okay, let's sell some stuff i don't know we're probably never going to use the handgun again but we'll keep it because it's only okay we want that pile bunker though you know, I'm gonna sell. I'm gonna sell this grenade launcher to get some monies. We'll sell these arms. We don't need them. We'll keep those legs because I, you know, I still like um, the bipedal. All right, let's let's equip all our stuff. Let's get our new loadout. Let's get that minigun. Get that pile bunker. <laughs> I can't wait to try that bad boy out, dude. There it is. I don't want to lose resilience, though. Jesus, that's so bulky. Alright, let's see. So the weight is a lot heavier. The energy load's a lot worse. Boost speed even goes down, but everything else goes up. It's It'll make me so tanky. Like, look at, look at that. Oh, we're getting it. I don't care if it, you know, takes a lot of money. All right, here you go, guys. There's the new, there's the new Death Watch tank, bro. That's crazy. Let's hit that arena up. Ooh, we've got we've got quite a few uh, new arenas here. Let's take care of this guy first. Dude, look how sick we look. You know we look sick. You can't look me in the eyes and look me in the eyes and tell me it doesn't look sick. See, you can't do it. You can't tell me that because you'd Arena be wrong. Combat aptitude evaluation right, let's go. Program number twenty six entering rank E. What's this guy got? Subject AC. Bitter promise. I don't know, is that like a laser pistol? An assault rifle? A, I don't know what the heck he's got, but it don't matter. Because we're going to charge into him, pile bunker on him. Call it the day. Oh yeah, we don't have the... Yo. Oh! Yikes, okay, the range on that is very, very bad. <laughs> Alright, the final bunker is hard to... Oh! Oh! Okay, the pile bunker is going to be hard to utilize, but we're going to get there. Oh, why am I not? Okay. Concluding evaluation. 
when I get the shield break like that, or break their posture, whatever you want to call it, and stagger them, I need to assault boost at them and then charge pile bunker. You know, oddly enough, Arena so I need to focus to more program. Number 25. on just uh, keeping that chain gun going this whole time. You know what I mean? Subject AC, infection. Call sign V6. He has Major. like those electric guns that uh, Solo was using in that last Commencing mission. Evaluation. I think his name was Solo, something like that, right? Main system, activating combat mode. Isn't the best plan. Target destroyed. Concluding evaluation. Well done. Like you gotta really be up in their grill. You know, the chain gun, I don't know if I'm uh a hundred percent digging. That guy gave me a run for my bunny though. Well, he got me down pretty weak. Do I have repair kits in the arena? I didn't even pay attention to that. Little Z, didn't we already smoke her? See, that's what I'll just tell myself. Anytime I feel bad about destroying a mech, I'll just say that the person escaped, you know? You can't tell me I'm wrong. That aptitude evaluation program, number 24, rank E. Subject AC, UAU. UAU. Little Z. UAU? I don't like that. Commencing evaluation. Main system activating combat mode. All right, here we go. We're gonna land a pile bunker this time on little ZE. Oh, My tank looks so cool. Concluding evaluation. Well done. I love it. All right, so I don't. I was focused really hard on that pile bunker, and we landed it. I feel like she was already really weak when we landed it. So I don't know how much damage it does, but I'm assuming it's going to do massive damage, considering how hard it is to land. Maybe the tank isn't the best plan for that. Maybe, you know, doing like a smaller, faster... Oh, that's a lobotomy is his emblem? <laughs> okay. And I paid attention. We do not have repair kits arena in the arena, which makes sense. Evaluation program. Number 23, rank E. Final evaluation. Is it Tetrapod? Is that a missile launcher? Call sign V7 Swinburne. Season's gonna be flying all over the place. It's gonna be hard for me to uh main system. File bunker and Oh, 
Oh, golly. Man. I don't know why I thought I had, I forgot. I was sitting here trying to... sure if well done. the pile bunker is the strat though to be honest with you i'm not sure i love the shoulder mounted grenades though those are cool and i and i really like having the laser cannon on my left shoulder for the range and whatnot and when they're like i could have that charging and then when they're far away just let it rip Congratulations, you have surpassed rank E. Darn right. We are glad to oversee your development as a mercenary. All Mind exists for all mercenaries. Oh, I forgot. Yeah, let's upgrade the repair kit effectiveness. Oh, this is going to be good to direct hit damage. So when you stagger them, you'll be doing more damage. We'll do that as well. You go through those um, chips fast, though. All right. Infiltrate grid 086. I thought I had two missions. Here's the request from Balan Industries. They want you to carry out an advanced survey of the central ice field. To confirm the information Walter brought to them about the Coral Convergence. As for how to cross the Aulian Ocean, this is the Intercontinental Cargo Launcher installed on the upper level of Grid 086. You could use it to launch your AC to the ice field. Grid 086 is occupied by the Dozers, outlaws who treat Coral like a drug. It's also the territory of a belligerent group of arms dealers who call themselves R.A.D. Be prepared for a perilous journey. I'll be here to support you, Raven. Thanks, I, 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 Ray. Ire. Ire. Let me handle getting us into the grid. I'm fairly adept at analyzing systems. And manipulating them too. All right. Well, that's scary though, because can she manipulate my AC if she decides she doesn't like me anymore? Commencing infiltration to grid 086. Creating backdoor into system. Deactivating lock on vertical catapult. Connecting steam cylinders. Launching. Yo, that's so sick. Come on. Give me a break here. All right, Raven. Let's get to work, shall we? We shall. Main system activating combat mode. I sent you the marker data. Let's head toward the elevator going to the upper level. Chain gun's actually pretty, uh, 
pretty tight. Oh, golly. Just get piled, Bunker. Straight off the cliff, too? Oh, he didn't fall all the way. Frickin' chainsaw. How did my... Oh gosh. Chainsaw beats a pile bunker. Carving me up, bro. Looks like you're having fun, Taurus. You know, RAD loves a good welcome party. Come on in and let's get acquainted. How courteous. Let's take a look on the offer, Raven. Who the heck is shooting at me now? I should not have lost so much health against that guy. I can't, the, the the pile bunker man. I gotta get better at using it. I think. Wait, there's enemies. Or is it, oh, they're down here. Oh, wow. Okay, you go through chain gun ammo quick. Curious. Okay. This has been very sloppy. One repair, but it's all right. We're alive. Maybe A will come in hot with the uh waiting, Told you we love a good party. Well, you're no slouch, are you? Bump. There's sneak attacks.
I really. This level is really cool. It's neat to not have just another like really wide open area, you know. How many? Yeah, we're 404 more chain gun ammo. Well, I just feel a need to destroy everything, you know. Tread carefully. I see what you did there, Air. Right shoulder ammunition at fifty percent. It's hard, I do like that. That's enough. Major point. Nice surrender. Just not with the losses. Come on, I'll let you through. Help along now. I don't believe you. As soon as she has up her sleeve. Yeah. Shall we, Raven? We shall. Ooh. Resupply. We were just running low on ammo, too. That means we're gonna have to. You're not afraid of anything, are you? That means we're gonna have to fight something, like though. Which is a good thing. Annihilate enemy MT squad. Oh! Shut up, Cinder Carla. Alright, I'm feeling like... Now, not that I'm going to change or not that it matters, but I'm feeling like the tank is not the best.
set up for this because being airborne seems a lot better. <laughs> but we're sticking to it. Jesus. You see what I mean? Like, oh god. Like... was wild, bro. Golly, second try though. Not bad, I guess. Enough, Taurus. Been miserable knowing you, but I guess playing nice is a smart choice here. It's the second time you've said you that. Go up top, right? Let me show you the way. Guide a tour from Cinder Carla herself. All right, that was a really sick dude. I just even though it sucked when I got hit by it, it did a ton of damage when it would swing the giant grinder thing at me while I was in the air and just smack me out of the sky. That was tight. That was a cool fight. I definitely think like being a tetrapod or something that hovers would be a lot better than the tank there. The tank, it was hard to dodge some of that stuff. I'm sure there's ways, but I was having a hard time.